Welcome to the fourth video in the Ranarec Studio recorder series. In the previous video, you recorded and edited an automated test. This video describes the options for running and debugging your automated test. The simplest way to execute a single recording module is to use the Run button in the File view. Remember not to touch the keyboard or mouse during a Ranarec Studio test run as this can interfere with the test and cause a failure. When the test completes, the test run report appears. Let's look at additional options for running your recording. Ranarec Studio uses a predefined delay between actions to allow time for UI elements to appear. You can enable Turbo Mode to reduce this delay and speed up test execution. Turn Turbo Mode on or off using the button in the Recording Module toolbar. Usually, you will run individual recordings only when editing or debugging them. When testing your application, you'll run test cases from the Test Suite view. This solution currently contains one test case. This test case includes a setup region with one module to start the application under test, two recording modules, and a teardown region to close the application under test. Let's make sure the demo app is closed by running the Close AUT module. Now, click the Run button to execute the test suite. After the test completes, the test run report appears. Click the arrows next to each test case in the report for more details about the test run. In addition to the Run button in the File view, there is also a Global Run button and a Stop button in the Ranarec Studio toolbar. Use these buttons to run or stop an entire test suite at any time without having to open the test suite in the File view. To the right of the Stop button is the Debug Mode button, which enables or disables debugging. Ranarec Studio must be running with elevated privileges to use Debug Mode. If necessary, you will be prompted to restart the application as an administrator. Be aware that executing tests in debug mode reduces overall performance by about 30%. For more information about debugging recordings, refer to the Ranarec Studio User Guide, which is linked in the video description. Sometimes, you might want to run just part of a recording. To do so, open the recording in the File view and use the Context menu to run just the selected item. You can also run just the actions prior to the selected item, run the recording from the selected item, or begin recording after the selected item. This option is useful for adding actions to an existing recording. Watch the final video in this series to learn how to identify UI elements with Ranarec Spy and add actions for these elements to a recording.